We live in the age of plastic. Practically every aspect of modern life uses plastic. But there's one giant problem. Plastic waste is piling up on our land and in our oceans. In Canada, less than 12% of nearly 4 million tons of plastics used each year is collected for recycling. Globally, as little as 2% of plastics may actually end up being recycled. The good news is that more and more citizens, businesses and policymakers are working to make change. The linear take-make-waste approach isn't working. It isn't sustainable, financially or environmentally. And it's a missed opportunity as valuable materials are literally thrown away. Fortunately, there is a solution. It's called the circular economy. A circular economy will change how we live. It will keep materials flowing in the economy and out of the environment. In a circular economy, there is no waste. We reduce what we don't need and reuse what we do need. It's not recycling as we know it. It's a new way of doing business and managing our resources. By moving to a circular economy for plastics, Canada could capture the $7.8 billion in lost value currently going to landfills. Not only is it good for our pocketbooks, but it can transform our lives so they are focused more on environmental, economic and social well-being. People are already taking action, but we need to go much further. We need a culture of creativity and inventiveness. We need to create strong policies that foster new technologies, operations and investments. Businesses will be responsible for the plastics that they produce. Standards will increase recycled material and products. And problematic single-use items will be eliminated. A circular economy will help us reduce plastic waste, use and reuse products for longer, improve recycling and recovery, shift to renewable energy and restore our ecosystems. By embracing a circular economy, Canadians can build a thriving economy while also taking care of our planet for today and for future generations. Learn more at circulareconomyleaders.ca